Bam, bam, bam. Here is my comfy sona. Oh, Abba Shizu. Here's my comfy sona. Amazing art by Camille and H. Oh, there's multiple arts. Thank you so much for drawing my comfy sona. Bah. This is a lot. Bum, ba -da bum. Oop. Being attacked by a fly right now, too. How dare. Should be dead. It's cold today. Shizu. Shizu is a fluffy wool ball. She's actually a sheep, but because of her unusual appearance, she didn't even know who she was. Yeah, I'm now looking at it, and my god. Somebody needs to be sheared. <laughs> That's, that isn't even like a sheer thing, actually. That may have to be like a weed whacker. <laughs> oh, look at the smile, though. What is this? Introverted mode, wears sunglasses and a mask, enjoying music silently. No, I'm fine with that. Are these little hands coming off? I... I'm very scared. This is not a sheep. This is an eldritch horror. <laughs> but it's super fluffy. But imagine how bad it would be if that got into the rain. Or just like, yeah. Dirt, dust, grime, anything. <laughs> so cute and fluffy. You know what? You're right. I'm sure Shizu takes care of their fur. Fur, fur wool. Wool. <laughs> They'll be fine. That's so funny. <laughs> she felt so lost and started a journey. Wandering the world, crossing over mountains and valleys. One day she found a forest owned by the shepherd. There were many sheep and some also looked unusual just like her. She was surprised to discover that she was not the only weird sheep in the world. Everybody's weird when you get down to certain parts, so yeah. Not weird at all. We're all just different and unique. Um, ba -bum. She was surprised to discover she was not the only weird sheep. The shepherd held story time every night. I wish. <laughs> After a long and tiring day, she would quietly lurk in the sheep pile and listen to him. Due to social anxiety, she didn't dare to talk to any sheep. However, the sheepies always wholeheartedly embraced her uniqueness. Gradually, her heart walls started breaking down. She felt safe here. From that moment on, she decided to follow the shepherd for as long as she could. <clears throat> Number one. That's such a sweet story. That's so down to earth and just adorable. We could turn that into like a children's book. And this kind of art style would work perfectly for it. Who did that one? Nitochrome. Oh, Camille, you did such a beautiful job. Hirokimi as well. This eldritch horror. <laughs> Not the smiley face. Anyway, that is adorable. And Alba, 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 Alba. let me zoom out first. But blah, blah. There we go. And Alba Shizu, thank you for always like translating pretty much everything that goes on on the channel. <laughs> You've been so useful to everybody on Twitter. So thank you so much for that. Thank you for the cute, comfy Shoma. It's cute, not horrific. Um, it's a bit like Mimi Q. It could go either way. It's cute, but then also vaguely terrifying. <laughs> it could be both. It could be both. But yeah, no, honestly, I wish you like translate to anything that I put on Twitter anytime that I'm like running late and I have to like leave a message on things. It's very sweet. So thank you so much for sharing all of that.